Alexis. I'm Ashley, the office manager. And I'm Bob, the rector's warden. We are here to talk to you about the um, tease for this weekend and the scripture passage where we're going to be learning all about the Good Shepherd. Bob, what is the Good Shepherd to you? The Good Shepherd for me knows his sheep, hmm. knows them very well, but more importantly, the sheep know him. Yes, they do. What about you, Ashley? Protecting the flock. Yeah, protecting the flock. So the Good Shepherd can mean a lot of things to a lot of us. Um, this past week, we've had our staff retreat here. We're at the Grace Place. Mm -hmm. You can see we're um, right outside of Noah's Ark in their nursery and classroom here. It's pretty awesome. Um, but we've been learning about our spiritual gifts. We've been learning about our Enneagram, which is different personality tests that we've done together to see how we can work better as a staff. Um, because some of us have strengths and some of us have weaknesses and how do we have those gaps and fill them in like the body of Christ and be able to work together. So some of us actually had shepherding as our strengths. I know Father Christian did. I think he did shepherding. Um, I did. Actually, that might have been one that we all had. But um, ultimately, the good shepherd is Jesus and he laid down his life for all of us. So be thinking about that this weekend as you're spending time with your families, talking to your kids and your spouses about what the Good Shepherd means to you and how you can be a Good Shepherd in your life. Bye! Bye! Bye.